That's a good fish. There was one. That was a nice hit then. 42 centimetre piece, not gonna weigh it. All right, what's going on guys? So we're out doing some perch fishing again today. It's a pretty hot day, even though it's like mid-September, it's, yeah, hot. So not expecting much, but today we are gonna be focusing on the Texas rig. Now, I have fished the Texas rig a fair amount. I have caught a fair amount of fish with it, but I don't feel 100% like I'm that good at fishing it. So yeah, I'm gonna dedicate at least this morning to Texas rig fishing. I'm gonna start fishing some small stuff just to get a couple of fish caught. Just so, yeah, it's not blank. And then, yeah, we're gonna dedicate some time fishing slightly bigger lures on a Texas rig, try to pick up a bigger perch than what I normally get. So yeah, that's the goal. So we're gonna try to get some small fish behind me and then we're gonna get moving, get some big fish caught, hopefully. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. There's one straight on it then, first draw. There's a few off it to be fair. <laughs> okay, there's perch here then. I'll first drop down that. There we go, fourth cast. Fourth cast and it's a good one. It's getting followed up by a good one as well. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. There we go, fish fourth cast on the prototype. I'm not really gonna show it to you, but not really what I was planning on using this morning. I've just come from another spot. I didn't have a single bite, so I just wanted to put something small on. Just to see if there's fish here. I just think at the other spot there was no fish. <laughs> so yeah, these ones seem pretty fired up anyway. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. Oh, that is a good fish. And there's a big one following it as well. There's a big one following it as well. Oh, that's even bigger one that's following it. No way. No way, no way, no way. No way. Come here. Come here. Yes. Go away. Even bigger one followed that up. Oh, new prototype from LMAP. It's not even a big bait, but it's a big Freaking perch. Well guys, started off with a smaller size. Didn't expect to get this beast. 42 centimeters. Thick set perch. What a beauty. So happy with that fish. What an awesome fish to start the day off with. 42 centimeter piece, I'm not gonna weigh it. Oh, so casual back down. Well guys, I was not expecting that fish then. So happy to get that. Second fish of the day, 42 centimeters, probably two and a half pound-ish, but so happy. There was an even bigger one that followed it. So yeah, I'm gonna try and get that one now. But yeah, what a start to the session. There's one. Yes. Oh, and a big one following it. Big one following it up. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Okay, that's interesting. I nailed that. Oh, that's on the small Texas rig. Choked it. Oh. Yes. Here we go, third fish of the day. First one actually on a Texas rig. Oh no, it's fourth fish actually. Yeah, it's no monster, but there was a big and followed it up. It wasn't like as big as the other one I had, but it was like a one and a half pound, maybe two at push. So I'm gonna release this a little bit over here. Super fired up what was following it up then. And this little prototype thing again. Floating bait. I can even pop it under here. Look at that. They seem to be wanting a faster presentation today. That one nailed it. Like mid water straight retrieve <laughs> rather than twitching on the bottom, so yeah, not perfect for when I'm trying to film a Texas video. So, yeah, I think it's gonna be a diff difficult day, but we'll get some fish caught. We'll get some fish, that's for sure. 
it was my I was planning on fishing super slow on the bottom. Typical Texas style, but feeling like we're gonna have to fish a bit more aggressive today with how the fish have been. <laughs> Which is fine. We can still fish a Texas rig aggressively. There's one. Oh it's off. I could say aggressive retrieve then we took it on the drop then again. nailed it <laughs> how did that not get hooked look at that but yeah just started retrieving a little bit more aggressive again and straight away so that might be the key right now the water's just started moving which is always annoying oh there's tons of perch under that oh nice ones as well that's so weird There we go. Very next cast after this last one. I'll be looking fish again on the Texas rig. Little prototype thing. Boom, baby. <laughs> Either they're just switching on or I've finally figured out that they're uh, yeah, on a different pan today. Number five, though. I think they've all been on this little thing as well. This little uh, floating killer tail thing it's not like anything I've ever seen this low as well which uh, yeah might be why what's doing it might be why it's working so well there's one running at me <laughs> Straight off that far man, that was so cool. Nice little textbook perch, top lip hook, lip hook set. Same little bait, absolutely killing this today. Pop. That was one. That was a nice hit then. It was a tiny fish though. <laughs> but that's probably the best hit I've had and it's like the smallest fish I've caught. Little beauty, nailed that. See about it. Gonna leave this spot in a second. Stopped biting out, boats come through, but it's another spot I can drop back in when I'm walking back down. And uh, yeah, there's definitely a few fish here. I've seen a couple of nice ones following. I'm not managed to get them to bite yet. Still open to get something on my other rod, to be fair. Caught everything on this. A curly tail grub. It's a TP floating stretchy one, so it's different presentation to most things. There's a fish. <laughs> On a troll, a little guy. Ripped him out of the water then. See, buddy. It's literally just trolling this then, not even paying any attention. Don't know my fish this bit because it's pretty dead usually. <clears throat> I'll have another cast back. Well that one just hit it though, just in case there's another one there. Yes, there is. About the same size. I think. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. What a beauty. This really is a nice lure for it, getting the numbers. See you bud. Size six hook, three and a half gram weight. Very simple rig, but it's doing it today. There's another. <laughs> Man, these little guys are doing a really good bite on this today. Look how they're just taking it in. Looks like they love it. Two from that same spot, Texas rig. And another on the drop. Find a nice little shoal of them there. Whoops. Let's tuck it again. 
There we go. Third from this little spot where I am now. Nothing big, but let's get a few bites when it's been tough. It's about one. A bit further out. Yes, man. I know there'd be some better ones around. It's not a monster, but it's better than what I've just been catching. So I'll take that any day. There might be a couple more of them off that shelf as well. Oop. I think this is, well, I mean, I know this is the only one in the country as well at the time I'm filming this. So I'll be very careful not to lose it. I think I might have one other, but still. They're, uh, yeah, I think there's only 10 in existence <laughs> each size of these. So they, uh, there's not many about. So I know the perch definitely haven't seen them. But it's working really well. No. Just drops it in the edge at the new spot and a perch took it instantly. Oops. At least another perch here. It's a little bit more colour in the water at this spot than where I was before, so we'll see how that affects it. But there's another fish. Just as I start doing a little troll again, one just nails it. <sighs> These little ones are so easy to catch today. Just want to catch a better size. There's one. There's one right out in the middle. Another tiny one there. Right in the middle on the bottom. Don't want to lose this. This is the only lure that's caught fish today. I've caught like at least 60 fish on it. No way. No. 